Hey guys, welcome to the latest Football Shirt February video here on my YouTube channel. Great to have you back. I'm Drew, and if this is your first time visiting the channel, please like and subscribe and stay up to date on all the things I post here. I've been posting quite a few videos on shirts over the last couple of weeks, as this is Football Shirt February, something a little fun to do to showcase some of the shirts in my collection, as well as some of the ones I'm unboxing this month as we head towards March. So today we've got another video that I'm going to be show, or another shirt that I'll be showing off. And this is a special shirt that uh, I just picked up. I uh, just arrived during the week and uh, I'm excited to show it off. I've actually still got the tags on it, just recently took it out of the bag and we'll be uh, giving you a look at it uh, today. Now, this is a shirt that I wasn't very keen on when I first saw it. Uh, in fact, when the images were leaked and I, I saw it on footy headlines, um, I thought it looked like um, a fake shirt. I didn't think it was actually a shirt that was going to be actually produced and sold. And uh, yeah, I just thought it was just, uh, you know, kind of one of those leaked kind of prank shirts that you kind of see that uh, people post every once in a while. But uh, to my surprise, it uh, has actually been released. And uh, we've seen this shirt as well. Uh, we've seen the shirt released for Liverpool, Tottenham Hotspur, and Chelsea so far. And of course, I'm talking about the new Nike Air shirts that have been released for the 2020-2021 season. Now, let me grab this right off my rack, and I'll show it to you right now. All right, so there it is. Still has the tag on it. And that is the Nike Air shirt that was released by Nike. Uh, I think it was in January that this came out. Uh, mine just arrived this week. And do you know what? I absolutely hated the shirt when I first saw it. I thought it was um, silly. I thought it was ugly. I thought it was just um, a boring shirt. And as like I said, I didn't think it was a real shirt when I first saw those images leaked. Um, to my surprise, they were actually legit pictures um, that were leaked. And I actually came around to the shirt uh, and quite like it now. Uh, and it it was one of those things that I had to see it on someone to actually like it. Uh, I saw the uh, image of Jordan Henderson there with Liverpool uh, on social media uh, wearing the top. And um, I decided to actually really like it uh, compared to when it was first posted on, on uh, online uh, with the leaked images. Now, this shirt is very similar to this season's third shirt. Uh, in the way that the sleeves are, it's got the uh, the two tone or the two material sleeves, and I'll show you the third shirt, which I just added to my collection as well um, the other day. Uh, I'll show you that in just a few minutes, so you get an idea of how these are very similar. But this has uh, also the similar red that the third shirt this year has for Liverpool, the red striping, and it's very it's just it's the same template. It's the same template that uh, Nike used for both. Um, of course, you've got the, the Liver Bird with the LFC, Nike with Air under it, and the Nike Engineering tag uh, on the bottom. There's not much to it. You've got the tribute to the 96 there on the back. And then, of course, you've got the gray pinstriping that matches this gray bit. Now, again, I didn't like it when it first was leaked, but then once I saw it on, I really liked it. And as I've said before in videos, I don't buy a lot of white shirts because they get dirty easily. And I can already see a couple of little minute things that um, this has picked up already. Um, just a little bit of dirt and dust has been rubbed off onto it that um, that is annoying me. And so hopefully I can get this into the, the wash if I don't return it and, and get some uh, stain remover on it to get it to uh, to uh, get those spots out. Um, this is a shirt actually that I want to wear a lot because I do really like it. I think it's really nice, um, but it's something I'd wear with say a hoodie or a jacket over it uh, just because again, don't want to get those white, uh, this white dirty. Um, but uh, yeah, we'll see what, what happens with that. But let me show you the third shirt now from this season and you can kind of see how it's very similar. So you've got pretty much the same color, just a little bit of a, a color difference. Of course, the badge is the same. Um, the, the big difference is in the Nike swoosh and the Nike logo, that old school Nike logo that I love compared to the just the tick. I love that old school Nike logo, and that's huge uh, on there. And then you also have um, just like, so I say the template's the same. You've got the, the two-tone sleeves. You've got a light gray here or a dark gray, I mean, uh, with black. And then you've got 
instead of the checks you've got the stripes on the on the other shirt then you also have the red striping down the side and like i said the color is the same and then you've got the tribute to the 96 so it's very much just the same shirt but color colors different slightly different and you've got the pin striping now as i've said already in a previous video uh last week i showed off uh my favorite liverpool top that i have in my collection favorite away top that is so check back in the videos you can see that but um one of the things that I said uh, was I was really disappointed with what Nike has done this year with the Liverpool shirts. Now I've got all three of them now, or four of them, uh, in my collection. And uh, here's the red one, which I think is compared to what New Balance did in previous seasons, especially in the last couple of seasons, I was super uh, disappointed with this. Um, I didn't care for the color tone of the collar or the sleeves. Um, and I don't like the striping on the side, and I just thought it was boring. It was dull. And collecting RB Leipzig shirts as well, um, it's a very similar template, if not the same template, uh, for the shirts. But again, Nike has a lot to a lot to live up to, and I think that they can do much better in the next season or the next couple of seasons. Um, but again, for their first set of shirts for the club, I thought they were very disappointing. Now, these two, for me, are definitely the pick of the litter uh, this year for Liverpool uh, compared to the red shirt and the green shirt, which I have over here uh, on the side, which uh, I can't actually reach just at the moment. But uh, I think these two are the picks of the litter this year for Liverpool. And if Nike can build on what they've done with these, then I think that the club will um, have a nice future with Nike as the kit provider. Now, this shirt is said to be the fourth shirt uh, for the club, but I have no idea and i've not heard uh if the club will actually wear these i think it would be awesome if they wore these because i think these are are really attractive tops um and again much better than the the teal green shirts and much better than the home red shirts for this season um perhaps they could wear these against manchester united if they play them again or when they play them again uh, as well as arsenal uh but uh, there might be a few limited times that they could wear these um so perhaps in the Champions League, we could see Liverpool wear these tops. Uh, I guess I'm assuming with black shorts, possibly white shorts. But um, yeah, it would be really nice to see them wear these because they do look really nice on. And I think this was um, a really uh, exciting uh, special release from Nike because we've only I've only seen three teams have these, Chelsea, Tottenham, and uh, Liverpool. And in a way, it's kind of like the shirt I showed recently from Roma, I believe I showed that on Thursday, which was last year's third kits, which had a throwback feel to it. So uh, Nike going out with a little bit of a special um, a special top for, for these three English clubs. So I'm going to pop that on and we'll see how it fits and uh, how it looks uh, once wearing. Three, two, one. Okay, so there it is, the specialty Nike Air shirt for Liverpool this season made by Nike. And man, that's a great fit. And that's the fit that you can come to expect from a Nike top. I like the way it looks. I like the cut of it. And like I said, I didn't like it when it first came out, at least when I first saw it uh, in pictures, especially the leaked images. Uh, but once on, uh, it, it really caught my eye and it, it really looks good. So I'm going to be wearing this all day today. Merseyside Derby coming up this afternoon. So I'll be wearing this for the game. And uh, yeah, hopefully we won't be spilling any food or drink on it. Um, but uh, the way I eat, I'm expecting to get something on it. Um, so guys, this is the shirt for today. I hope you like it. Uh, let me know what you think in the comments below if you like these Nike Air Tops that have been produced this season for the three English clubs. And uh, also subscribe and like the channel or subscribe to the channel and like the video and uh, stay up to date on everything I post here on my YouTube channel as we expand some content and uh, bring some more things to you uh, throughout the coming months. But we only have a few more days left in February. Today is February the 20th, so it is uh, February the 20th? Yes, February the 20th, so it is football day, uh, football shirt February, day number 20. Uh, you can go back, check out the playlist to see all the videos in order and uh, get a look at some of those shirts that I've posted. A lot of people really liking those RB Leipzig and Red Bull Salzburg shirts that I've had up there and recently got some great, uh, great feedback on the Rangers top as well as a Sheffield Wednesday top, which uh, was a bit surprising to me. But um, yeah, go back and check out those videos and see what I've posted over the last 20 days. And also uh, my social media handles are there in the 
uh, the description below so you can follow along on Instagram or Twitter and stay up to date on what I post here. Uh, so guys, I'll see you soon and be back tomorrow for Football Shirt February day number 21 with another new shirt.